Hi and welcome back to Scotty's Tech.info. I'm Scotty with my co-host Cletus. Here's a fun one. You're just sitting around using your computer that runs Windows 10 and one day the icons, some of the icons on your desktop just disappear and instead they are replaced with black squares. So for example instead of showing, uh, say it's a PDF file, instead of showing a thumbnail preview of the first page of the PDF, it just shows you a black square. Now, uh, this can happen for any different types of files, not just PDFs, but uh, you may hop on Google and you do a search and there's all kinds of different solutions with like type obscure commands in the command prompt and blah blah blah, search for a particular file and folder and, and delete the files and, or folder and, and the problem is that it's actually a hidden set of files and it just gets all complicated. So what's the easy way to fix this problem if you have black thumbnails? Well, the first thing you're going to try is to just refresh the desktop. So what you do is you click on a blank part of the desktop where there are no icons or windows and you just tap the F5 key on your keyboard. And this should cause all the icons on your desktop to sort of flicker as they're all redrawn. The other thing you can do is you can right click an empty area of the desktop and choose refresh and that accomplishes the same thing. I use the F5 key because it doesn't require any clicking. That might work or it might fix it for like a minute or two and then suddenly you, you know you'll see your your preview thumbnail and then suddenly like a minute or two later poof they're back to black squares so if refreshing them doesn't work then this is what you do so all you're going to do is you're going to go down and click start and type disk and you should find disk cleanup so just go ahead and click that and run it and obviously you're going to want to clean up your c drive if you have multiple drives just make sure you pick C, click OK, and that's going to give you the disk cleanup for Windows tool. Uh, you can clean up some of these other things if you want to, like downloaded program files, or I usually just do temporary internet files, and all the rest of them, I don't do anything with them. Uh, you just make sure that thumbnails is checked at the bottom here. That's the one that, that absolutely must be checked. And then you just click OK. Are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? Yes, I am. Then the disk cleanup is going to run, and poof, it's done. That's it. Uh, what should happen after the disk cleanup is done running is all the icons on the desktop should kind of flicker as they're redrawn because you just deleted the thumbnail icon cache, and uh, you should start seeing an actual preview of the file that was a black square before. If you don't, you can try the F5 or the right-click refresh trick, that should fix your problem, but in some cases it doesn't. For example, I recently had this issue with uh, the uh, Adobe Acrobat Reader DC, the, the free PDF reader. So I'm like, okay, the, the icon disappeared, they're black squares. I tried this trick and it worked for about 10 minutes. And then what happens is Windows goes through and it sort of indexes all your files, including the files on your desktop or whatever folder they're in and it generates new thumbnails. And when it does that, um, they, they reappeared for a while. I had a proper PDF thumbnail and then poof, it turned back into a black square again. So if this trick doesn't work, then what you need to do is think about um, getting a replacement for that piece of software. For example, in my case, this was happening with uh, the Acrobat Reader and I remembered, ah, hang on a second, didn't I just get an update for Acrobat Reader? It automatically updates in the background, and I went, aha, yeah, just yesterday I got this update, and I'm going, ah, oh, geez. So I search on, on their support site. Of course, there are no reports of it yet because it's a recent update. And then I thought, you know, I really hate the Acrobat Reader now. It used to be a double-click. It opens a file quickly. For me, even on my incredibly fast computers, um, I double click on a PDF and it takes sometimes 30 seconds to open like a very, very tiny PDF file. And I'm going, okay, so maybe the quality of the Acrobat Reader DC software is dropping. Kind of like when you get Windows 10 updates and it borks your whole computer. Right. So what I decided to do then is actually switch. And I've actually switched to the Foxit free PDF reader which uh, is a very small download and you install it. It's a free PDF reader and lo and behold, when I double click on PDF files, they come up instantly. So um, after I installed Foxit, I left Acrobat installed, my PDF thumbnails were still black. So then what I had to do is 
do the thumbnail clearing trick, do the disk cleanup, delete the thumbnails, and then poof, I had PDF thumbnail previews again. So in the case where this trick does not work, you really need to think about the fact that software is constantly being updated, and if it's something like a PDF reader, uh, find an alternative. Because if you're having this problem, they broke something. And I know people don't like to actually go and, you know, change like, but I love my, my Acrobat PDF reader. I don't want like a different one. I know, I understand, like I'm a creature of habit as well. <laughs> but since I switched to Foxit, for example, for PDFs to solve this black thumbnail problem, I've been super happy. Um, sometimes it also fixes other problems like slow loading times and things that you didn't even know you had. And by switching, Yes, you have to learn a slightly different tool, but in the long run, you're going to be a lot happier. So that's it. For more techie tips, see scottystech.info. Thanks for watching. See you next time.